What's good, YouTube? It's your man BG Tech Life, and today we got the Pixel 7a on deck. As you guys know, I downloaded Android 14. So today, what we're gonna talk about is my Pixel 7a setup with Android 14. Let's get into it. First and foremost, guys, let's just talk about this case. When it comes to this Pixel 7a, I've became really in love with the just the Google silicone cases. These cases are from made by Google. I got them off the website. This is actually the exclusive coral colorway. And a lot of times I had problems with this colorway, guys, because I really didn't understand what coral was or what color to base like my wallpaper and things off of because I like to coordinate. But it's really, to me, coral is a light salmon. But I just really thought this was a fire color when the Pixel 7 a came out. It was the exclusive color. This coral silicone case I had to order straight from Google. It's only on Google's website. All the other colors of the silicone case are actually on Amazon. You can get them next day. But uh, coral was really special and really dope. That's why I picked it up. I like this colorway. I actually like this color a lot. And they hold up pretty well. And they have the aluminum buttons. Now for the lock screen, I went with the big clock. And as you can see, I went with like a pink type palette. I think all of this goes together just like basically different. I think salmon or I think that's what this phone should be called salmon instead of coral. It's just a different shade of pink almost. But I think it hits really hard looks really good and i got the wallpaper which is going to be the same wallpaper on my home screen now when we get to the home screen guys it's actually different it's going to be different from a lot of you guys home screen because i went with nova launcher i cannot do the regular pixel uh launcher for the simple fact that you cannot move that at a glance at a glance to me it's just not aesthetic i think that google actually has the best clock widget in the game but when you put this clock widget on the home screen and you got at a glance that it just doesn't look aesthetically good this is aesthetically pleasing so shout out to nova launcher and just shout out to android because the amount of customization that you can do with ease is definitely a one can do this on my iphone but as you can see i got basically the google clock looks really good and aesthetic nice and clean and i got me some apps down bottom and because of nova launcher i was even able to customize google doc a different color this search bar right here is just another shade of the salmon actually going on down here that kind of like brings it all together and as you can see i got some different icons also guys i got an icon pack called delta is in the play store is an icon pack i'm not sure if it was free i bought it but i had it already installed on the phone a long time ago so i just reinstalled it and i tried it and i thought it just looked great it make the apps just look a little softer like it just goes really well i think with my setup with the wallpaper with the color of the device with the color of the case everything just feel like it's flowing especially with the search bar matching now of course i needed my google feed so i had to download nova companion swipe to the right and as you can see i still got my google feed going on even though i'm on nova launcher Cause I like this. I, I'll sit here and you know, give me a, a, of course everything not popping up my phone in airplane mode. But I sit here with a hot cup of tea or whatever, and just scroll down here and look at different stories or videos and things of that nature. I really like this little uh, Google feed that you can just swipe to the right and get. So I always keep that installed. Shout out for Nova Launcher for having that on deck. Also, now if you swipe back over to home and then swipe to the left again, what I got going on here, guys, is basically Google Notes. I like Google's Notes app, it's really dope. And one thing I like about the Notes app is how good the voice uh, dictation is on the Google Pixel 7a. So I can make notes just off of, if there's something on my mind, I don't have to sit there and type it, I could just start talking and take a note. Because a lot of times I'll get ideas about a video or just something I wanna do, and I'll completely forget, I'll know it was something that I wanted to do, but I forget how I wanted to do it or what was different about it. So a lot of times I was just, you know, jot things down with the voice dictation and also just making lists and stuff like that just doing a lot more planning makes me like better at this youtube stuff and just better at life period and also just a little positivity guys because everybody needs some positivity i like these aff affirmations i know that's kind of like you know a lot of people look at that like oh bg you like affirmations like yeah everybody need a little positivity 
so i actually found the app for affirmations i'll show y'all when we get to the app drawer but it's just like you know with all the negativity going on boom i'm thinking adding notes i'm saying positive messages so i'm kind of like manifesting you know this phone is all about this phone is my secretary so i'm planning i'm manifesting i'm researching on this little device right here guys all the time you gotta be thinking think about that forward progress and if you swipe over again we got the calendar of course calendar is super important because you want to plan i'm bad still with setting reminders and setting a schedule for myself and i really that's something that i really need to do is like right now like i'll get in grind mode or then i'll just get in like i don't care anymore mode and i won't do anything so right now i'm in grind mode and i'm just overly doing stuff and then i'll go into a mode where i overly underdo stuff and it's like i need that medium where i need to plan and i need to schedule things better but that's something to look forward to coming to the channel me being more planned out as far as my content and things of that nature swipe to the left again and of course guys uh i just put the netflix app down here because it was just going to be an app dedicated to youtube music that's how i rock out i love music old music new music rap music r&b whatever i listen to it a little bit of it all now i just wanted to have a big youtube music widget but it looked funny when you make it like the whole home size or the whole screen size so i just added netflix in so to keep me updated on what it is to watch on netflix but i just listen to all type of music so i love this little turntable app right here i go to it and i just let the pixel 7 they play the music through the speaker sometime but that's pretty much how my phone is set up with the home screen and things of that nature and if you look down here basically i mean these are apps everybody know because this is like my social media phone my research phone like i said uh you got instagram threads x i'm on all of those bg underscore tech life so go ahead give me a follow on those socials i'm real interactive um facebook i actually have a bg tech life facebook page so you can check me out there also and telegram at the bottom is like more core more so core apps and as you can see these delta icons look freaking amazing i, I just think they look so good with the phone but we got youtube gmail the play store chrome and the camera so all important stuff and i got the voice assistant on one side of the search bar and then i have the google app on the other side of the search bar for me to search and as you can see it's just real customizable again shout out to the nova launcher you can see swipe up and we just got a whole bunch of apps here guys and it's pretty much everything you guys know it's nothing you know special on here we got a little call of duty on here i like to play that this device can play call of duty pretty well we got csr racing i did a video on that also another app let's go let's talk about blendy blendy is a really good app right here blendy wallpaper that's why i actually got the wallpaper that's on this device right now for i think it's a dollar 49 on the play store a bunch of good wallpapers guys so you might want to check that out if you're in the wallpapers and aesthetic setups and things of that nature csr racing you gotta love that and next to CSR Racing, we got Delta. Delta is the icon pack that I'm rolling with right now. These are Delta icons. So that's on the Play Store also if you want to check that out. But yeah, I was saying Google Notes, but it's Keep Notes. And I like Keep Notes. I, I use utilize that to uh, jot things down and uh, think about things, things of that nature. Of course, Nova and Nova Prime. I got the paid version of Nova, of course. That's about it, guys. I just wanted to share my Pixel 7 8 setup with you guys because once I went to Android 14, I kind of like reset my phone brand new and I just went ahead and set it up again. Sometimes I like to do that. Makes it feel like a new phone, made it feel exciting, especially with the update. But it's your boy BG Tech Life. If you're not subscribed, get subscribed. And if you're not following those socials that I just shared, go ahead and follow them. It's your boy BG. I'm out. Peace.